One bite for me. One bite for you. One bite for me. One bite for Hey, hey, hey. hey. Mm -hmm. Hold up. What you're doing there? You're hogging all the snacks. Hee hee hee. Can't you see? I'm gearing up to grow some new sprouts. Sprouts? How dare you? I'm your tuber, the main event. You're stealing my lunch. Hey, I'm doing this for the good of the family. The whole potato patch. You gotta understand, kiddo. No. What the hell? Something's sucking me dry. It's like a vacuum cleaner. Ha, serves you right for trying to hog it all. Now it's all mine. Oh wait, it's taking mine too. Yeah, that's sweet potatoes for y'all. Gotta give them a good toss and turn now and then otherwise. Those sneaky finds put down their own roots and slurp up all the yummy nutrients meant for the big sweet potato tuber. Hmm? Hey, big bro, why are you lying down? Sigh, I find standing to tiring. Might as well just lie down. Mm -hmm. But if you lie down like that, will your sweet potatoes grow big? <coughs> Sigh, who cares about growing big sweet potatoes? Who are you going to feed them to anyway? <laughs> Young fella, you still don't get it. Huh, um, I don't like listening to you. With your attitude, how can you grow good sweet potatoes? When the time comes, I'll definitely sell for a better price than you. All right then, go ahead and grow. Let me show you why method is more important than effort. 2,000 years later. Well, look how big I've grown. Wow, these horizontally planted sweet potatoes really have a good yield. Hey, why don't you look? I've grown bigger than him. What's the use of just being big? They're little sweet potatoes. Not only is the yield higher than yours, but they also taste softer, stickier, sweeter, and are even easier to sell. Sai, see what I told you. Take a look at these sweet potatoes. Want to buy a couple before you go? Just give me a couple of the small ones to try. If I buy the big ones and no one at home eats them, it'll be a waste. Sai, see, that's why the small ones sell better. Hey, what are you spraying? You're spraying it all over me. Oh, sorry, my hair was growing to fast. So I sprayed some plant growth regulator on it. What do you need that for? Having long hair is great. You can change your hairstyle every day. Uh, I don't understand your fashion. Anyway, my hair is long enough as it is. Then stay away from me. Don't spray that stuff on me. Oh no, my sweet potato tuber. Why isn't it growing at all? All your nutrients were eaten by your long hair and those little roots. How is your sweet potato tuber supposed to get enough to eat? So this is the price of beauty. Oh, the growth of these sweet potato vines wasn't controlled. Now the sweet potatoes can't grow big. Oh, you sweet potato vine using an umbrella now without sun. How are our tubers supposed to grow? This is a beauty secret I learned from studying ancient texts. Seriously, can using an umbrella really make our tubers better looking? Um, well, the book didn't exactly say how it makes them better looking. I knew you were unreliable. I'll do it myself. Don't include me in your weird plans. Oh, what is that? Sweet potatoes can actually flower. The secret texts don't lie. You must regret it now. Ha ha ha. What's the use of having a stupid flower? Yo, 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 so jealous. You just wait and see. A few moments later. Where'd this umbrella come from? Giving the sweet potato shade and making it flower. How about it? Aren't you impressed by my beauty? You were so focused on looking pretty up top that the flowers sucked away all the nutrients. Now you've just got these pathetic little roots. Ah, my tubers. What the heck? Sweet potatoes are short day plants. If they get a little sunlight, they'll flower. If you don't pick the flowers, they'll waste nutrients and affect the tuber yield. Oh yeah, sweet rain from the heavens. I gotta chug it all down. Hey little bro, tasty stuff. Of course, sucks to be you. You can't reach it. Oh yeah, who are you looking down on? I'm getting a drink one way or another. The audacity. So you've been hogging the food on your own all this time. Hey. Who gave you permission to grow roots? What's the big deal? It's fair competition. Every plant for itself. That's it. Life is unfair. Almost forgot this step. What's this? I'm pulling this whole vine up. You grow these tiny roots and steal all the nutrients. How is the sweet potato supposed to grow? Heh <laughs> heh. Who said anything about fair competition? I've got connections upstairs. Good thing I turned over these potato vines. If the vines are allowed to grow their own roots, the sweet potato yield will be terrible. Hey, you shameless herb. Why are you just peeling off my skin like that? We're both red-skinned sweet potatoes, so how come you're orange inside, and I'm just white? Duh, my orange color means I'm packed with beta-carotene. You white potatoes are just starchy, not sweet and super dry. What's so good about that? Um, I'm not that basic white potato anymore. I'm an upgraded variety from Japan, and yay! I'm white, but I'm also packed with beta-carotene, and my texture is sweet 
and deliciously waxy. Oh, really? I don't believe you, unless you let me have a bite. This Japanese milk candy sweet potato is truly the snow white of the sweet potato world. <coughs> One bite of this baked potato has the waxy texture of taro, the fragrance of yam, and the sweetness of honey all at once. What's in that pot next to us? It's so dark and spooky. They're planning to bury us with ash. What ash? It looks so dirty. Why don't they just sprinkle us with salt and deep fry us instead? Why are you always so dramatic? I'm not burying him. I'm just planning him. What kind of restaurant is this? Such good service. They even chopped my food for me. Oh my god, a worm. Huh? They even added seasoning. What is this taste? Her, her, almost forgot my protective layer. Eating this clean one should be fine, right? <laughs> nope. Planting potatoes with wood ash is great. It prevents diseases and pests. But now they don't allow burning straw. Oh. Hey, potato, you want a wife? Cause if you do, I'll send one over her. Is that for real? Man, being a single spud gets kind of lonely. Hurry up and send her over. Oh, Kellogg. I don't want to. Nothing good will ever come of this. Bro knife, what are you thinking? We're not even the same species. It's cool. You're both in the nightshade family. It's not a big deal for you to grow together. So I get a wife, but I have to carry her on my head. Hum, you're not happy about it. Since we're in the same family, let's just make it work. Crafting an eggplant onto a potato, the whole nightshade family in one plant. Guess we're having disantion for dinner tonight. <laughs> hey, big bro, how come your head turned green? Sai, what nonsense are you talking about? This kind of talk is not welcome. Hey, take a look for yourself. R, R, my, my head, how did this happen? It's probably because you were planted to shallowly. Just now, when it rained, the soil washed away, causing sunlight to directly hit your body. The chlorophyll in your body all gathered together. <laughs> No, it's over. This is poisonous now. Oh dear, these green-headed potatoes, it's a pity to throw them away. Should I just try my luck, peel them, and eat them? Hey, what's this all about? You cut off all my leaves. How am I supposed to Sunday? What's this? It doesn't look like it grew from a potato. Aya, what kind of random stuff are you connecting to me these days? If something weird grows, it's not my fault. Two thousand years later. These are both from the nightshade family, so they can be joined together, as expected. One plant can grow to different kinds of crops. <coughs> hey, that's enough. Don't you dare make me sprout. Hey, heh heh. A little thing like you is poisonous. I don't taste anything. Hey, you better believe it. Just wait till I sprout. The solanine in my body will go through the roof. You'll be a goner then. You hear me? Yeah, right? I don't believe you. I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna eat. You're really asking for it, aren't you? He's off. Nope. You. You. Oh, you really are poisonous. If I didn't have a few tricks up my sleeve, you rats would have eaten me ages ago. How am I supposed to carry on the family name? Can you still eat sprouted potatoes? HM, should I risk it? <laughs> 